Hope you're having a nice, safe, enjoying all this beautiful January winter weather. Today, we are going to be starting on the teachings of Jesus, and we're going to be including how his cousin, John the Baptist, um, played a part in telling people about Jesus ahead of him so that they kind of knew a little bit about him when they came. And we're going to learn today about John baptizing people and Jesus um, being baptized himself. Jesus the Word. When John the Baptist baptized people, he always talked about Jesus, even though he had never met Jesus. And yes, he was a cousin of his. Remember, he was Elizabeth's son, but we think the family was really rather large and they probably didn't live close to each other, but um, he knew about Jesus and went about telling people out and walked around and told ahead of Jesus travel so that they knew a little bit about him when he came. As John dipped his hands into the cold, clear water, he said, Jesus, who sent to be, was said to be God's word. Jesus knows everything. God wants to tell us. As John baptized people, he said, Jesus will bring the truth and grace to everyone on earth. He baptized people who wanted to follow Jesus and live the life God wanted them to live. Some people didn't believe him, but John kept talking to everyone he met. When John finally got to meet Jesus, he was so excited. He told everyone, this is Jesus, the man I've been talking to you about, and God sent Jesus to, to, to us, hooray. And then we are going to hear about how Je when Jesus was baptized by John. While Jesus was living in Galilee, his cousin, John the Baptist, was preaching out in the country of Judea. The people loved John and came to see and hear him whenever they could. Sometimes the crowds of people came to see John by the Jordan River. When the crowds came, John would tell them, change what needs to be changed in your life god's kingdom is near the people would promise to change their lives and then john would baptize them and show them that they were a new person in god's eyes i baptized you on the outside with plain old water from the jordan river but nothing is compared to what who is coming john would exclaim the one who is coming will baptize you with God's own spirit. With God's spirit, you will be changed from the inside out. When John was saying this, Jesus appeared. He asked John to baptize him, but John wasn't so sure. Me baptize you? I think it should be the other way around, John said. But Jesus insisted, please do it, John. God does amazing things in baptism. So John did what Jesus asked and baptized him. All the way under the water in the Jordan River, Jesus went. When he splashed up out of the river, Jesus saw the skies open up and he saw God's spirit. It looked like a dove gracefully floating down to land on him. There was a voice too. This voice said, this is my son. He has been chosen and marked by my love. He is the great joy of my life. And with that, we want you to think about, yes, and following when you guys are out day to day, try to think about like how Jesus would do things. And I heard someone say this year, their new thing, their new goal for this year is they're going to try to be more kind. And I thought, well, that's a good goal. And try to think about how to be that light to the world, just like Jesus was. So, all right, we'll see you next week.